1.6 kilometers away from the capital city of Chennai, in Ramnad district, villagers in Kenikare are very happy today. Today, there is a man who's promised them that this water body that you see behind me will be revived. He's called the water warrior in India. And I'll introduce you to the 35-year-old Nimal Raghavan who has been going on the venture of protecting and reviving lakes in the state of Tamil Nadu and across the country. Nimal is on to his 145th lake project in Kenikarai town in Ramanadapuram. The lake which residents in the region say tasted like Amritam, elixir, has for the last 15 odd years not seen any water. With a small white bottle in her hand, 57-year-old T. Saira Banu has come to the event. She wants to make the officials who come to her town taste the water that she gets at home. Taste it, she says, to demonstrate the hardness and the salinity of the water. Kenikare, the eight acre lake once revived, will ensure that the salt water that the residents now get will become like the old elixir. The event was inaugurated by Ramanadapuram DMK MLA Kadar Bacha Muttaramalingam. Makal pain badum ni, berdua dua bidang macam macam. Ia perlu dinaik teri niirin, berdua ubur ini dah agak kincir. Abi niir tiak mungkin kadek kira bodoh. Mata perti, makal kudir pain badik kira itu kulo orang kanan. Wai perlu itu. Kau ada kalangan lain, makal ada pain badik itu baru minat nabi kiri. The Kenikare Lake Restoration Project, which is approximated at rupees twelve to fifteen lakh, is mostly crowd funded. The excavator for the restoration has been sponsored by Nanban Foundation and the project is expected to be restored by the second week of April this year. Nimal, an engineer by qualification, returned from Dubai where he was working to his village Nadiyam in Perugarani town in the Tanjavur district to build his dream home, a three-storey building. But the Gaja cyclone that hit the state on November 16 that year not only wrecked havoc in the lives of the people in the Delta region of the state, but also changed the course of life for Nimal, who was then 30 years old. That time only we got to know the actual problem here, that is the water scarcity. Hmm. According to reports, over 100 TMC of water is being sent into the sea from the Kaveri River Basin because there is not sufficient water bodies to store them says Nimal. So Nimal, talking about this issue, can you explain more about it because 100 TMC of water is like really huge and you were saying that the requirement for a city like Chennai would be way way less than that, right? Yes. So actually, uh, the concept is we need what is, uh, we need a place to save water. So if the water body is like this, yeah, we can't save water. It has to be like this. Mm. Then only we can save water. But all the water bodies here in Kaveri Delta, uh, almost all the water bodies are either encroached or it's not maintained properly. So as a result, what happened? We are unable to save water in the water body. So each and every water body is interconnected. Also, each and every water body is connected with the main source of water, which is GA Canal, Grand mm -hmm. Anakit Canal. His first project, 565 Acre Periculum, was in his hometown of Peravurani. A team effort of similar like-minded individuals with the help of crowdfunding, villages support and at a cost of approximately Rs 27 lakh, the lake was restored. The before images of the region shows a completely empty barren land but now the lake has abundant water, pond herons flying around and more importantly, the lake is capable of irrigating more than 6,000 acres of land in the region. The groundwater level too has seen a rise from 300 to 400 feet to now the groundwater level is at 60 feet. Around 140 kilometers from Kenikare is Kolikade in Tanjau district and here is where Nimal had restored his 142nd lake. The lake which is spread across just 3 acres of land stands as an example of the change. 
The Kollakkada village panchayat leader's husband, 52-year-old Sami Appan, was on ground working along with Nimal's team to get the lake restored. Nangala nangala farmer da. Full and full farmer arke nala. Yengal ko nde seasori area nde pavudi pura ke karal tani nde ullu angama. Nde near nle uru angama nala. Yengal ko nde karal tani ullu angama. Nala 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 pavu angama. Nno orishe nala ke tinga nala. Tur kripta alu nde yengal ko karal tani ullu vandri chingra nala. Pakatlo or time onu per time onu kati kudra angama. Ada mention puni dana angga near nle uru angre uru angama nala. Yengal ko nle nle nala nala pavu angama. Nle nde nle nala ramba. Upudan ini ulah ulah pun tu, beli ni langgar ramu padi ke. The lake restoration has desilting, making boundaries, connecting the inlet and outlet. Also, in during lake restoration, you will get enormous amount of sand. Yeah, and you are not going to sell the sand. So what we are going, what we will do is like we will make the boundary stronger. So at least a tractor will go in the boundary. And another thing, what we used to do regularly is. We'll make a lake island inside the lake, artificial lake island. There we'll be planting many natural species of trees. So that trees will attract many extincting beast birds and all, and that itself will create a next uh, forest cycle. Nimal's vision to restore lakes has also been supported by several good Samartians who come as sponsors. He also has his own foundation, Mega Foundations, and is associated with Exnora International, Bio to Soil Foundation. ऊर कुड़ी ऊरणी कापों नाम तामिर बरनी The Tamil Nadu state budget announced by Finance Minister Palani Vel Tiagarachan allocated rupees 258 crore under the Tamil Nadu Irrigated Agriculture Modernization Project for repair renovation and restoration works being undertaken in 309 tanks In the rural development scheme the finance minister has set aside rupees 800 crore for renovation of 10000 water bodies in areas consisting of minor irrigation tanks ponds and uranies see only for water only we are working on we are fighting if we take water to a place means then the whole ecosystem will change now i am doing project in jammu i am doing project in uttar pradesh i am going to start project in kenya also next week so the journey like continues so uh, uh, so i don't think i can go back uh, even there is a no, there is no way so wherever there is a demand for water i go i work i get water nimal who says his journey will continue till the time there's a lake that needs restoration adds that his perception of a home changed with the cyclone and similarly people who witnessed the lake restoration nimal says changed their perception on how to respect water bodies See, suppose if I am restoring a lake in a village area, means I'll rarely see a plastic inside the sand. But if I am restoring a lake in a town or city, means I rarely see sand inside plastics. That's totally opposite. Even for 10-15 feet, if I dig again and again and again, plastic will come. So plastic is everything in my mind is our mother earth, our responsibility. That's it. It's our responsibility to take care of our mother earth. It's our mother, right? Who is going to take care of us? It's us. Tamil Nadu has been a state which has been in water wars with Karnataka and Kerala. But people like Nimal say that if Tamil Nadu focuses on saving and restoring its water bodies, then the huge crisis of water can be averted. They also say that every individual in the country should think about a way in helping Mother Nature and what better way than to save every droplet of water to ensure that life goes on well from tanjavur i'm akshana senior assistant editor for the print